Matty, thanks for joining us and congratulations on your new contract here at Aston Villa. How pleased are you to commit your long-term future to the club? Yeah, delighted. Uh, really proud day for me and the family. Um, and yeah, just another step in the right direction, really. And I just want to keep progressing. Um, and yeah, every day working hard and, and, and trying to get better every day. And thankfully, and uh, thanks to the club, they've rewarded me a new contract and I can't thank them enough. Yeah. It feels like you've been here a lot longer than you have. We're obviously just coming to the end of your second season at Aston Villa. Does it feel like home here now? Yeah, no, nah, it definitely uh, feels like home. I love coming here every day to body more and working hard. Um, and obviously I've only been here a couple of years now, but um, time's gone so fast. And obviously I've only had a season playing in front of the fans as well. So the first season wasn't as good. Um, but now nah, I love it here. I feel like home here. Um, yeah, every day coming here training is, is great, yeah. Talk about progressing. There's a clear vision here for where the owners, the CEO and the head coach want this club to go. Is that one of the most important things when it came to signing this new deal? Yeah, I can't thank them all enough, really. Um, coming from the owners down to Christian and, and the gaffer and the staff, since the gaffer's come in, he's been really good with me. Um, we've got a really good working relationship and I just try and go out there and do, give my all for him, really, in training, try and improve every day. And then the, when the Saturday comes, I just try and produce. So. Um, yeah, obviously I've committed and I can't thank all of them a lot enough. Um, it's been yeah, really good since they've come in, so hopefully things can keep going. How important has the manager been for you? Yeah, he's been brilliant, yeah. Um, just yeah, since he come in, obviously I've, I've got a goal, what he wanted me to achieve and what he wants me to keep achieving and I'm trying to do my best every day for him. Um, and yeah, as I said, I just want to keep doing it and producing. You've spoken a couple of times this season about wanting more goals, more assists, keep progressing. We've seen the hard work here at Bollymore Heaves come to fruition in recent weeks as well. But is the best still yet to come from you? Yeah, I think so. I think this is just a, um, a step in the right direction for me. Um, obviously, I've signed the new contract. I want to keep pushing on and progressing. And um, I feel like I'm in a really good place, yeah. I feel really fit and strong. And obviously, I'm producing on the pitch with the, with the forward play, which is what I want to do. Um, there's numbers. That's what you need as a fullback. So, yeah, nothing changes really for me. Um, I'm just really, really happy to stay here. Yeah. You won the club's Player of the Month award for March. We all know how great the support is here. How important is it and how much confidence does it give you having that backing behind you? Yeah, I love, um, I've got a really good relationship with the fans and as I said, I'm an um, all-out committed player and hopefully they can see that and that's what I want to keep doing really on the pitch, um, showing them what I've got and we've got such a good fan base here. The club's so big um, Yeah, and I love putting the shirt on every week. So um, yeah, hopefully I can just keep, keep playing well and, and, and giving them my all, yeah. Just looking back, what's been your favourite moment in an Aston Villa shirt so far? Uh, I've had a lot of good moments in a short space of time, really. Um, I think the goal against Brighton was really good for me because um, obviously I've been working hard on the um, forward players you like to get goals and assists, and that was just a starter, really. So I think that was like a bit of a relief for me, yeah, that goal. Obviously, the Everton one at home was nice as well. Um, but yeah, that, that goal away there was, was really good for me and my confidence. Of course, you're now a full international with Poland as well. And last week, you qualified for the World Cup in Qatar later this year. Can you just describe what must have been an incredible feeling for you and the team? Yeah, now nah, what a night, honestly. It was unbelievable, something I've never experienced before. Like, even the, the, um, when I was having the pre-match sleep, normally we have a sleep after lunch, and like, I could just hear outside of the, of the hotel, the fans were going mad, flares everywhere, and it was just like, wow. Um, just trying to like, focus on the game. Um, and we got there and we turned up and obviously our big game players produced and scored. So, nah, unbelievable moment for the country and, and to be part of it was, was unbelievable for me, yeah. This is a club that always is always proud of its players' achievements on the international stage. Do you feel that support when you're away and also when you return from the staff and your teammates? Yeah, yeah, I think um, obviously we've got a lot of international players here. Um, and when we go away, we've, the, the, the coaches here are always messaging and stuff. I've got a really good relationship with them. So for me personally, they're... They helped me a lot and yeah, they, they, um, I was non-stop texting a few of the coaches about uh, putting crosses in for Lewandowski. Uh, but now, yeah, it's great for the players to go away on international and obviously it's performing on the biggest stage. So it's great for the club as well. And this international break just gone, the, the, um, the international players that went away all, all done really well. So it was great for the club as well. Just finally looking at, ahead to the rest of the season, how determined are the team to push on in these final few games to finish as high at the table as we can? Yeah, yeah finish strong. Um, that's the aim. Just to Obviously, we've got eight games left and they're all massive games. Every time you put the shirt on for Villa, it's a big game because you've always got to prove yourself. You can, you can play well during the season, but you're always judged in your last game. Uh, so yeah, every time you put on the shirt, you've you got to perform and that's how it is here. Thank you and congratulations. Thanks, Cheers.